crime ends in a trap that justice sets. Crime does not pay. Thank you for calling. How can I help you? Yeah, this is Kessel. I want my uh, rebate card, my voucher. Okay, sir. Can you please confirm your date of birth? 3 16 1950. 3 16 1950. Yeah, 1950. 5050. Five, zero. Yes, I see that, sir. Give me uh, a moment. Okay. And you were. And you were calling in to claim your hundred dollar gift card? That's right, this is Kissel. Okay. So this hundred dollar gift card will be sent to you directly at your mailing address within the next two to three business days. Okay. Thank you. And you and you can use this gift card for one year, anytime, anywhere, any place. It is valid on your grocery shopping, clothing, dining, entertainment, gifts, electronics and services. Okay. Okay. Or anytime. Anywhere, anything, you can shop for one year with this. Anything, okay? anything. Can I, can I go to McDonald's? Yes, sir. You okay. can go to any of your favorite restaurants. Ah, good. I love McDonald's. I, I like the chicken nuggets the best. Okay. Okay. But, sir, as this will, be coming, to, as this will be coming to your, as this will yeah. be coming to directly at your mailing address. Okay. So, what? the only thing you need to take care of, that will be just your one-time activation and your shipping fee of $5.95. 5 dollars 95 Will that be manageable for you? Yeah, yeah. What do you want me to do? How do I pay it? Okay. Sir, you can use uh, any of your plastic card to pay this. It can either be a Visa or plastic a Master. Plastic card. I will be giving you the... Okay. Yes. All right, go ahead. Send it to me. Yes. So now, in order to get you all set up, you simply need to handle your first access fee of five dollar and ninety-five cents. Okay. Will you be using a v Will you be using a Visa or a Mastercard? It's a Mastercard. Okay, and it's a credit or a debit? Credit. Okay. Do you have a middle initial in the name that appears on the card? Nope, just my name, Kessel, Frank Kessel. Okay. This is yeah. Kessel. So please. Just state and spell your first and last name as per your MasterCard. Frank Kissel. And how do you spell that, sir? Spell what? Your last name. Oh, K-I-S-E-L-L. -L. Kissel. Common spelling. K-I-S-E-L-L. -L. Kissel. Yes, and your first name is Frank. Spell as F-R-A-N-K. Is that correct? Right. And Frank, I have your telephone number as nine zero nine. Nine zero nine. Are you with three one seven nine five five one? Okay. Now, Frank. Yes. Great. Okay. Frank okay. Kissel is your name, and that's the name on the card, right? That's the name on the card because it's my card. Yes. Yep. Okay. Great. Okay. Now read me the sixteen digit. Yep. Okay. Okay. Great. What? Okay. Now read me the sixteen. Sixteen. Sir, let me repeat. Sir, let me. What? Sir, let me, me read the question. Don't oh. talk in between. I'm sorry. Read the question. Yes. Okay. Great. Okay, now read okay. me the 16 digit. Five one. Sir, can I read the question? Go ahead. I'm going to read you the number. You're not you even said. letting. You said to read you the so, number. Sir first, of, sir, first of all, let me read you the question completely. Okay, read it. Great. Okay, now read me the 16 digit card number, expiration date, and three digit CVV code from the back of the card. Can I talk now? Yes, sir. Now you can give me the card details. 5178-0590-5252-1375-525-006. Okay, let me just validate your card. Okay. I'm just going to read you back the card number. Just correct okay, me. Okay, read it back wrong, okay? and then I'll tell you if it's right. Yes, so the card number is... Five one seven eight. Yes. Zero five nine zero. Yes. Five two five two. Yes. One three seven five. Yes. Very okay, good. Okay, sir. I'm checking in my system. Yep. I'm checking in my system, okay, Frank. Check your system. And it and it is yes, and it is telling me that this moment of time, this card is not good to go. So can you please try with any other Visa or Mastercard? I know this is good. I just used it this morning. To buy a snow brush. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But right now, uh, it is not going through, sir. So can you please try with any other Visa or a MasterCard? Uh, 
Uh, let me try my visa. Maybe that one will work. Yeah, please. Thank you so much for understanding. Okay, you ready? I'm ready whenever you're ready. 4128-0039-8317-4817. Expiration date? 924. And the CVV? 423. 423, correct? Yes. So I'm, not just, no, I'm just going to read you back the visa card number. Okay, read it back. If I'm wrong, okay? Okay, I'll tell you. Go ahead. Yep, so you said it's 4128? Yes. 0039? Correct. 8317? Correct. And what are the last four numbers? 4817. 4817, correct? Uh-huh. Okay, so now when I ask you this question, sir, will you be using a visa or a MasterCard? Please say visa card, okay? Visa. So will you be using a visa or a... I already told you it was a visa. visa. I told you it was a visa. But yes, sir. So I have to follow follow a protocol, sir. So oh, please cooperate with me so I can I'm make trying. it quick for you. Okay? I just, all I want is my voucher. Yes. yes. So I'm, I'm here to help you with that. So okay. uh, just say visa card. Visa card. Okay, and it's a credit or a debit? Credit card. Okay, got it. Now, do All you right. have a middle initial on your... Sir, now, do you have no. a middle initial on your Visa credit card? No, it's Kissel. Frank Kissel. Okay. This is Kissel. I told now, you that. Yes, sir. Okay. So, Mr. Frank Kissel? Yes. Yeah, this card is good to go. Your Visa card is good to go, oh, and good. it has been accepted for this one-time charge. That's okay. Right. okay. Yes. Now, for the last time, please state your date of birth. 3-16-1950. Okay. And what's the best email to contact you at? frank175 at gmail.com. Okay. So that's uh, Frank, F-R-A-N-K. Right. Right. 175. Right. Right. At gmail.com. Correct. Okay. okay, so on the same email address, on the same email, you're going to receive everything in writing, and okay. you'll also get a copy of your gift card directly on your email account also. Okay, okay? thank you. Yes, now just be okay. on the line. Oh, I'm what? also going to give you... I thought you, we were done. Yeah. No, sir, I have to give you the confirmation number. Oh, okay. okay. So just be on the line. Okay, give me the confirmation yes. number here. Just be on the line. I am. Kindly verify your. Yeah, kindly verify your phone number. My phone number is 909-317-9551. Okay. And address will you like me to mail all your information to? 100 Main Street, Moravia, New York, 13118. And it's a single family house or you have any apartment number? Uh, it's a senior citizen facility. Just send it there. I'll get it. Okay. Okay, give me a moment. But, okay. sir, this is your address? Yeah, it's my address. So you stay why on would this I give address, you some, right? Why would I give you somebody else's address? No, I'm just confirming with you, sir. Yeah, it's That's my the, address. So you said, is it south or north? There is not either way. It's just Main Street. It goes east to west. Okay, so it's one. No, no, I'm asking you, is it south or north? It don't go north and south. It goes east and west. Okay, so I will just take it as then 100 Main Street. Right. And the city name is uh, Groton. Groton, right, right next to Moravia. We got the same zip. So you tell me, which uh, city should I put in? Moravia. M-O-R. Okay, sir. So. You got it there, Moravia? Yeah, I, yeah, I, I see that, sir. So uh, the address where you will get the shipment, it is 100 Main Street, Moravia, New York, 13... 073, is that correct now? No, 13118. Okay, sorry, 13118, right? Yes. Okay, give me a moment. Okay. 13118. One, one, okay, got it, sir. Okay. So now on the same address, the shipment will take place, 100 Main Street, Moravia, New York, 13118, correct? Okay, great. Okay, thank you. No, sir, now just be on the line, okay? Why? Because I have to give you the confirmation oh, number, I sir. Forgot. I haven't given it to okay. you yet. G give me the yes. number. What's the number there, Billy? Yes, I will. Yeah, I will give you. First of all, let me ask you this last question. Okay. Is your billing address 
is your billing address is the same as your mailing address? Correct. Yes. Thank you. So now I'm just going to read you this message and I will give you the confirmation number after this message. So just give me last one minute. Okay. Okay. So, uh, Frank, if after you receive, if after you receive the welcome package, read all the information and decide the programs are not for you, simply let us know by phone, email, or message, and we'll discontinue your and value pass and text the access. That if for? not well, what are you talking about? Sir, sir, I'm talking about your welcome package. Welcome I'm talking about package. your shipment. All I want is, is my voucher. I don't want no welcome package. So, sir, in the welcome package, only your voucher will be there. So, let me read this out to you. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Yeah. Okay. If after, uh, if, if not after, well, if uh, not well, um, sir, can uh, I just read, sir? Yeah, can go. you give me time to read just one minute? Go ahead. Yes, yeah, so I have to read you this message. After that only I can give you the confirmation oh, number. So okay. please give me the last one give, minute. Give me the confirmation number. So give me one minute. Okay, I'm ready. Go be, ahead. Be quiet. Yep. If after you receive the welcome package, read all the information and decide the programs are not for you, simply let us know by phone, email or message and will discontinue your and value pass and techsupproducts.com access if not well. Automatically extend your monthly coverage for forty nine ninety five for value pass benefits and techsupproducts.com benefits. Forty nine ninety five for what? Your first what are you talking sir, I'm about? Saying five dollar, sir, I'm talking about five dollar and ninety five cents. You just said forty nine ninety five for something. Sir, sir, I said five dollar and ninety five cents. But you said forty nine ninety five every month. I'm not paying forty nine ninety five every month. Sir, that is not applicable for you, sir, because you just want your hundred dollar gift card. That's all correct? I want. That's so it. For your, this is Kissel. Yes. I told you that. Yes, so, yes sir. Okay. So. A hundred dollar gift card will be sent to you in just one time payment of five dollar and ninety five cents. Okay. Okay. But but there are some additional benefits. If you want that additional benefits, then I don't need you have any additional benefits. No, I don't need any additional benefits. Okay, then then that forty nine ninety five is not for you. You okay. can leave it. Okay. Okay. Good. Yes. So okay. so now just give me last twenty seconds. Okay. Just bear with me for last twenty seconds. Go ahead. Yes. Twenty seconds. Best of all, your first. Yeah. Best. Yeah. Best, best of all, your what? first billing one only occurring fourteen days from. What? Sir, can I just read? But you're going too fast. I can't even understand. So, sir, it. After, so, sir, all this information will be coming to you in writing. So, please keep little. Well, then why are you telling me if it's going to come to me in writing? Because I have, I have to do this for the quality purpose. We are on a recorded line, so I have to do this oh. for the safety and for the okay, quality purpose. Okay, well, you don't talk yes. so fast. Don't talk so fast. Okay. Okay. Best of all, your first billing will only occur in 14 days from today. That gives you ample time to review the information in black and white and make an informed decision. Fair enough? I have no clue what you're talking about. I'm saying, sir, all this information will be coming to you in writing, but still, if you have any questions, any doubts, you can call us back on the toll-free number, which will be there in the letter of your $100 gift card, okay? Correct. Okay. So, just say okay. For what? Sir, I'm saying that we are going to send you everything in writing on your address uh, in two to three business days, okay? Sure. Yes. So, just say okay. No way! You're gonna charge me forty nine ninety five a month. Come on, I just want my voucher, sir. Give me the voucher. Okay, Give me sir, my so confirmation number. Okay, sir. So just take down your confirmation number. You don't want the additional benefits, right? You don't want the additional benefits. No, correct? I do not want no any additional benefits. Okay, not a problem. Then that uh, money is not for you, forty nine ninety five. No, because it's that not. is only if you want the additional benefit. I don't yes. want no. Nope, I don't so, want forty nine ninety five. I don't want that. Can't okay, afford so you that. Be then just pay five dollar and ninety five. Yeah. So you have to just okay. pay five dollar and ninety five cents for your one time gift card. I, that's what I'm paying. Yes, five ninety five. Is that okay? Five ninety five. Five ninety five. Yes. So is that okay? Is what? Sir, you said you don't want the additional benefits of forty nine dollars and ninety five cents. No, I do not want. No, I don't right? want the additional benefits. Okay, sir. So when so, everything well, will come out to you in writing? Okay, in writing. Yeah. Sir. Yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. When everything when comes to does, you out in writing, I will right. give you. Uh -huh, yeah. So uh -huh. I will give you the toll free the, number. The toll Just take down the toll free number. For what? What do I need a toll free number for? So you can cancel your additional benefits. I don't want the additional benefits. How am I going to cancel something I don't want? I don't want it. Do you understand? Sir, you know what? 
I cannot help you. I cannot give you the hey, card because you don't you have You scamming bastard. You do what I tell you. This is Kessel, you foolish fuck. Okay, that's it for these guys. But you know I had to call them back, so I got some different mopes, and they'll be up next week. And hit the like, please, if you get a chance. It only takes a half a second. Thank you. All characters, names, places, and plots used in your program are fictitious. Any similarity to persons living or dead is purely coincidental.